What is up, Pyromaniacs? Pyrostasis here. We're back in the world of Road Redemption. And, uh, oh, man. This is one of those games that I'm so happy and excited that I finally got my hot little hands on. Uh, saw this a couple weeks ago on Steam. Uh, thought it looked kind of interesting, but I wasn't quite sure. Saw it on sale today for, I think, like 10 bucks, And uh, I figured, you know what? Let's take a look at it. So I look at it, and it's like it's like Road Rash. For those of you guys who played Road Rash, and I'm not talking like the shitty Road Rash, the one that was on like the new gen consoles. Well, back then, and they were new gen. I think it was like the PlayStation One or something like that. I'm talking about the original Sega Genesis Road Rash back in the day, the one with the yellow Diablo bike. You know what? That's how bad it is. I still remember the yellow Diablo bike. It was it was amazing. So, anyways, uh, this is. I don't know. It's it's. I would almost say it's kind of a basic game, in the standpoint that there's nothing like truly amazing about this game, and and I don't mean that as an insult. It's it's not one of those games where you just like, ah oh, man, it's like completely different than anything else you've ever played, and it's just you know completely inspirational. And I love what they did. Blah blah blah. No man, this is a game about riding bicycles and bitch slapping other people and knocking them into cars and fucking killing them. That's it. That's all there is to it, and it's amazing. It is absolutely amazing. So uh, you, you can switch through a bunch of your different vehicles here. The different vehicles have different perks. You're going to notice in the top left-hand corner, it says normal, normal, hard, harder, expert, normal, etc., etc. The differences between these bikes are, for instance, like you can see the two normal bikes. They're basically identical, okay? They're, they're just the same right here. These two normal ones, there's no difference. But if we, whoops, whoops. We jump to harder, you can see the max speed goes up and the acceleration goes up a little bit, but look, the grip goes down, okay? Now, for those of you guys who don't speak motorcycle, um, and I, I don't either, I'm, I'm just posing, just, just so you guys know. Um, grip, from what I understand, is what allows you to stay on the road. <laughs> so, you know, if you're doing like 250 miles an hour and then you try and take a right angle turn with no grip, well, you're going to end up in the sticks screaming for mommy and trying to remove a tree trunk from your abdomen. Not a pleasant place to be. So uh, these basically, these harder bikes have shit for grip. But they have amazing acceleration and they have, well, actually, they don't even really have amazing acceleration. They're just a little bit better and they have a little bit better max speed. Honestly, in my opinion, at least in my stupidity, not worth it. Not worth it. So we're, we're going to just stick with one of the easy bikes because we're bad. Now, every time you do one of these races, it's, it's kind of semi like a roguelike in that each character has permadeath. So when you die... That's it. I mean, you're you're starting back over from scratch. You're gonna you're gonna have to re-roll, and 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 start back at the beginning. Now, right here, you can see this level one. It looks like we start in, I don't know, I don't know California very well, but we're just gonna go ahead and say it's Los Angeles. You start in Los Angeles, and I think Los Angeles is actually further south. Let's go with L. Well, no, L. A. is Los Angeles. Wow, I really am showing my stupidity today. Screw it. You start somewhere in California and you end up somewhere on the East Coast. That could be North Carolina, South Carolina, or fuck, I don't know. Um, and you see the little red skull. That means it's it's bad and you're going to probably die. So each of these missions, you have, you have a, a, an assignment or a mission. So for this one right here, we're supposed to beat a rival gang or beat rival gang members to the waypoint. If we do, we get $1,150. So... Basically, everything you spend right now on this, you don't get to keep, basically. You, like, any of it's... Oh, come on, buddy. Come on. Come... Whoa, 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 whoa. Breaking. Hang on. We're, we're going to knock one of these dudes off. What's up, bro? What's up, bro? Whoa, car. Okay, sorry about that. Sorry about that. Damn it to hell. Oh, no. I'm, I'm clubbing this dude now. I'm club... Get off me, bro! Oh, that looked like it hurt. Oh, oh, hi, officer. Hi, hi, hi. Okay, we're going to dodge inside of this. Oh, breaking. Oh, shit. Now, you can only swing the baseball bat and your weapons in one direction, but you can kick people from the other one, which is freaking awesome. Get off me. What's up, bro? Oh, oh, that looked like it hurt. Oh, into the car. Get off me. Oh, shit. Hey, officer. How you doing, sir? Oh, God! It hurt. Oh! Love this game. Love it. I'm telling you what, dude. 
There is nothing better than bitch slapping somebody at 95 miles an hour with the baseball bat. Oh, God, that almost hurt. Hey, get off me. Oh, sorry, officer. Oh, Jesus. Oh, no, that was just fucked up, dude. Can't believe he did me like that. All right, so I just blew my nitros. You can do that by double tapping the uh, control trigger. I don't know what it is. I play sixth. Oh, you son of a bitch. That wasn't my bad. Ah, oh, yeah, we'll retry it. We'll retry it. Anyways, as you're going through these missions and such, and as you're, as you're doing this stuff, you get to spend money, okay? So this money that you get to spend, you use that for, like, healing your guy up. Oh! oh. <laughs> get off! Oh! Ow! And, uh, like, healing, like, you see right now, I'm down to, to some pretty low hit points. That's, that's not a good place to be. That's not a good place to be. Uh, in fact, it's pretty... Oh! God! Wait... How can he... Whoa. How is it that he's able to swing from both... Oh, shit! That's just messed up. That's just messed up. That's absolutely twisted. I'm, I'm very butthurt over that. I'm very butthurt over that. You made it to level one. You're a loser. So we made 62 hit points. This is the permanent upgrades tree right here. This is your... Uh, if you ever played Rogue Legacy, this is where, you know, you're kind of investing in your castle, etc., etc. So you can increase your maximum hit points by 15 per level. You can increase your, your bike's awesomeness. You can get um, some more hit point redemption. And as you get further on, you've got all these extra upgrades that you can get down here. And you've got your little, your little chains. So, you know, obviously you've got to get this unlocked to a certain degree before you can access these three trees and then that one, et cetera, et cetera. And you can kind of see the maximum unlocks here. So you can see that I've invested in this one like once this one twice actually i think it i don't know you can see that they slowly fills up as you're as you're going along so this is where you would spend your hit point or your exp unfortunately i don't have any exp so we have to start back over so that heals you and then you start right back over and you do it again and like i said the missions do change so you know it's not always i don't think the same mission i could be wrong about that but the way the the fights go and i think the maps are procedurally generated so even if it is the same get out of here bitch even if it is the same uh missions over and over again the maps are different so this is a completely different map than we were using last time i love kicking them i just love kicking them get out of here bitch get out of here oh shit and you got to be careful because they don't they don't play around. Now I don't I, I don't know if there's a way to block. Oh! Ooh. Oh, did I hit him? Nice, knocked him into that environment. And that's one of the cool things about this is you can get environmental kills. Oh, excuse me, officer. Sorry about that. Pardon my baseball bat, bro. Sorry, sorry about that, bro. Uh, you can also see I can change uh, tools as we go along, which is kind of cool. So you're not stuck with the same tool over and over again. Oh, dude, that looked like it hurt. Oh, shit. Oh, oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God, dude. They do that to me every time. I hate that. That is bullshit. That is absolute bullshit. I can't believe they put that right there at the end. That is just messed up. So I guess I get absolutely nothing for doing that. You know what? No, we're going to retry that one. That one was just sad and pathetic. We are not going to get screwed up by that stupid freaking bridge. Every single time that bridge gets me. Oh, you're lucky I missed, bro. You were lucky I missed. I would have redone your dental work. Oh. Oh, shit. Get out of the way. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I like also how the cars get damaged. I don't know if you guys are noticing that. Oh, shit. Oh. All right, so we're in fifth place. Was that a nuclear sign back there? That's kind of scary. Oh! I think he hit that. I'm almost positive he hit that. Oh, Jesus, that looked like it hurt. Hi, officer. 
Shovel to the face. Ow. You know what? Fuck this. We're blowing out. Going. We're going ham with the Nos. Oh, into the turn. Who is that guy? Okay, we are now first. Okay, here's the bridge of death. Fuck you guys! Saved my Nas for the for the the right moment there. Well, maybe not. Who is this green dude? All right, first place, bitches. Oh God! That almost sucked. That almost sucked. All right, so now that we've actually managed to complete a mission, thank God. So this is the point where you all of these purchases only affect this run. So that means anything you spend here is all great and gravy, but it's not going to work next time. So you want to spend your money. There's no reason to hang on to it. It's, it's completely pointless to hold on to it. So increase the durability of all melee weapons by 30%. I kind of like that. Increase all experience earned by 15%. Uh, that one's probably a good one. Increase your critical damage by 30%. I kind of like that one too. So we're going to go with this because melee weapons, we definitely need that. We definitely need to use that. Uh, and then we come down to increase damage or increase experience gain. So if we do damage, obviously that's going to make me whoop some ass with my, my beatdown sticks a little bit better. But if I go with this one, that's going to give me a permanent upgrade in the future because it gives us more EXP. So we're going to go with that one. That one just seems to be a slightly smarter move, at least in my opinion, which probably doesn't mean much. All right, so we get to pick which weapon we start with this time. We can start with an Uzi or we can start with none. Uh, since we're going to start with an Uzi, we're going to get rid of the baton because I really don't need the baton. I've never used the Newsy. I'm I'm a little I'm a little shocked by this. This is gonna be great. Not only that, but I didn't see what my mission was because I was too busy. I was too busy getting all excited about my Uzi. Oh shit, dude. Oh dude, this is fucking badass. Except I suck with that. So whoa, whoa. Okay, okay. I'm a little tripped out here. Oh, dude, officer, fucking quit it. All right. So what's my job here? What is my job? Other than beat the hell out of people. Sorry about that, bro. Dude, I am whooping ass. Uh, I hear him. Oh! Oh, I'm... S oh, shit. Hitting it. Whoa! Wait, is that dynamite? Or is that a wrench? Wait, what is that? Uh, what is that? That looks like dynamite. Oh, God. Fuck, y'all. I'm moving on. I think it's explosives. I don't know how to use it, though. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what that is. I'm a little, I'm a little weirded out, though. Um. <gasps> you just slap it on him. Oh, that's fucking amazing. That is amazing. They're sticky bombs. Hey, officer. How you doing, buddy? No, no, it's okay, dude. It's okay. <laughs> Sorry about that, officer. All right, can we do that again? I want to attack a few of these guys. Hey, buddy. You look like you needed to pick me up. Oh, damn it! Well, that hurt. That I defeated Kasselhoff. Is that like Hasselhoff? Hey, hey, officer! Officer, you, you keep you keep it in line. You keep it in line. Holy shit, dude! Did you see him coming down the middle lane, just owning people? That ain't right. That ain't protecting and serving. And serving up a bad old case of whoop ass is what it is. Oh, officer! Oh, cactus! Oh shit! <laughs> Oh, dude! Dude, that... Oh, did you see that car just go fly into the background? All right, moving, 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 moving. We are just burning straight through like we own the place. I'm not sure what our mission is here. I really should have read that. I'm thinking. Probably would have... Oh, it would have been awesome if I could have stuck him with it. Oh! Damn, officer, that looked like it hurt. All right, breaking. Whoa! Get out of here, bitch. Oh, I was gonna try and tag him as we move by. So I think I gotta kill one more officer. 
or let me let me rephrase critically explode one more officer mission one three out of four stars so I guess we had to hit four stars to be a real a real badass. That's not too bad. That's not too bad. Okay, so at this point, we got 702 bucks, which I guess kind of sucks. Uh, we actually didn't take too much damage there. So no reason to do that. Uh, I could recover some nitros, but I don't really see the point. I think we're just going to hang on to everything and see how we do. What do we get to pick this time? Defeat your rivals using kicks and grabs. Wow, that's, that's going to be challenging. So no weapons. Um... We just have to beat the shit out of people with our feet. Um, uh, okay. Wait, what? Oh, there's the grab button. Oh, good! None of them sucked. Oh, that was an explosive. Weapon kills don't count. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, the good news is I killed somebody. The bad news is I uh, killed myself in the process. So I got 60 seconds to wipe out two more dudes with a kick. Uh, it shouldn't be too hard, hopefully. Oh, missed him. Mm, nope, 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 nope. That would have been a good move right there. Damn it. Okay, there's one. Yeah, you gotta time that beat down, because it, it just really ends bad for you otherwise. It just really ends bad for you. Alright, so we ended up with 336 extra experience, which means we can increase our max health, we can increase our bike a little bit, um, or we can heat, increase our health. I think we're just going to go with, with our minimum health. That, that seems to be a better option. Leaves us with 180 XP. I can actually get uh, a 12% health increase across the board. No, I couldn't. Just six. I thought I was going to have enough to double up. But that also opens up this. Increase the durability of all melee weapons, which is nice. Start on level three with 1,500. Wow, well, that's like a nice shortcut. And you start each game with a better weapon. Each level of the skill gives you a better starting weapon. Wow, that's kind of cool. I'm kind of liking this. Kind of liking this indeed. Now, this game is in early access. So, um... You know, there's probably going to be some bugs. There's probably going to be some new features added. I know they are working on a competitive mode, which I'm assuming is some kind of maybe network multiplayer. It does look like it has four-player co-op. Well, maybe not necessarily co-op, considering your mission is to beat the shit out of each other. But uh, it does look like it's got some promise. Um, if you're in to Road Rash, if you grew up on Road Rash like I did and you played the shit out of it and you remember writing down cheat codes, well not cheat codes, but the save codes for Road Rash, then you are probably going to love this game. Like I said, it's a simple game. There's not a whole lot to it. You just basically drive around and bitch slap people with pipes, hammers, Uzis, and explosive devices, which is just really, really cool. So... I think it's good. I think it's worth the, uh, I, think it, I think it's $15 on Steam. I may be wrong. I know it's on sale today, but I want to say it's 15 bucks on Steam. Uh, definitely worth it, in my opinion. I'm going to have a hell of a lot of fun playing it personally. And it just, it's a nice trip down nostalgia lane for me because I grew up on this game. I mean, obviously it was called Road Rash, but it's basically the same game. In fact, this one is actually a little bit better than that because Road Rash was basically just a race. This one, you actually get points for beating the hell out of people. Cars explode. It's good times. It's good times. So anyways, let me know what you guys think in the comments section below. Do you like it? Do you not like it? Let me know what you think down there. Uh, the link to the game on Steam will also be in the video description. Highly recommend you go over and take a look at it because it is definitely worth it in my professional, my professional gaming opinion. Anyways, guys, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, slap that like button. Make sure you subscribe. I'll catch you guys in the next clip.